Are you looking to delete comments in Smartsheet but are not sure how to do it? Well, you've come to the right place because today I'm gonna to be walking you through the various different options open to you. So I've got a brand new sheet here open in front of me. Um, we've got no data in here at the moment. And before I show you the, the different methods, I do just want to, to start this video off with a quick caveat. And that is that sheet owners and admins are the only users who are actually able to delete comments. So if you are a viewer or maybe even an editor um, and these methods don't work for you, um, which they likely won't, then I would suggest that you reach out to the sheet owner or an admin to do these on your behalf. And, and you know that's how you, you might be able to get some of your comments deleted. But with that said, let's look onto the various different ways. So as I say, we've got a blank sheet here and we don't have any comments in there. So what I'm gonna first do is I'm gonna add a comment. So let's put that on row two. So to do that, I'm gonna click the add a comment um, button here. Um, and we've got nothing in here. So let's add our new comment and I'm just gonna put test for this demo purpose. So I'm gonna post the comment and we have our new comment. We can see the blue um, icon indicates that we have a comment on row two. Now remember, comments are linked to and associated with each row in Smartsheet. So the first way to delete this comment, let's say we don't want this comment, we open it up, we don't want, I put test, we don't want test, that was wrong. Um, to get that out and delete it, what you do is you open up this conversations panel and interface, you click the three little icons next to um, the, the, the comment itself, and then you simply click delete comment. Press the confirm button and your comment has gone. Excellent. So one of the, that's the first way of deleting comments, singularly, one by one, and just going into that conversation interface. Now the next way would be, let's say I've added some data here. I've just called it data, I've added data to row three. Let's say we've got, uh, I'm gonna add that comment here. So this second way works uh, works best when you've got data in your, your sheet and you, you, know, you, you want to kind of um, preserve it whilst you know, deleting the, you know, your comments quickly. Well, what you can do is you can actually move your data. So let's just say this was you know, particular uh, information. You move that down to dis dissociate it with the the row itself and then all you, you simply have to do is right click and the row and click delete and that will have deleted the comment as well. So that's the second way is simply moving data and deleting the row. Now the third way I'm going to show you um, and this is important if you know you're working with a completed data set or let's actually put this up to row one as well or you know you can't perhaps move move rows as easily and, and do that deleting option. So this is this is great if you've got multiple comments that you want to delete all at once. So what you would do here, let's imagine that all of these rows have comments or multiple do and you don't want to go through them one by one. So what you would do in this instance is first, and well, this is a recommendation, is first I would save a copy. So you save as new and just create a copy so that you know if anything was to go wrong, you've got a backup. So let's just call it copy. And this is basically created a second version and the original that we just worked from is intact. Now what we would do here, let's close this off, is we would simply left click and select all of the data, press control C, scroll down a little bit, we'll go to row 30. Make sure you leave a few rows just so you know where you are, you don't get confused. Press Control V, and that's transferred all our data to the bottom part of the grid. Now we just need to left click, scroll down to the end of the data set, which is row 27 in this case, hold Shift on our keyboard, left click at the bottom, right click, and then press Delete. And what that will leave you with is all the, the, the data that you had in the, in the respective columns that you need, and it was, would have deleted all of the rows with comments. And then you can just you know clean up here by deleting the unnecessary rows at the top. Hit save, and you're done. So that is how to delete comments in Smartsheet, either singularly or in bulk, if you like. I hope this video was useful. Please do hit the like button if it was, and do consider subscribing to my channel and checking out my Smartsheet training videos. 
got over 30 at this point. So if you're new to Smartsheet, I would really recommend going through those. And at the same time, I've also dropped a link in the description to one of my new training courses. So Smartsheet Training for Project Managers, it's called, and it teaches you all of the functionality of Smartsheet and gets you up to scratch. I would recommend that to anyone who's new to, to Smartsheet and perhaps even intermediates who are, are yet to fully understand or work through all of the functionality of the tool and want to, to familiarize themselves and get a better understanding. So do check that out as well. So with that said, I hope you have an excellent day.